So this is Pram Kai Mia. It's a really nice variety from Thailand. I just picked up this fruit. This was a drop. You can tell that it's still green. It's a green skinned variety, but when it gets riper, it has a sort of a yellowish tinge to the skin. And you can see where it hit the branch right here. Very superficial. Uh, but anyway, Prongkaimia is a delicious and versatile mango variety from Thailand. The name Prongkaimia, roughly translated, means that the taste is so good that even a Brahmin, which is someone who is good and virtuous, would trade his wife for the mango. In addition to being very popular in its native Thailand, Prongkaimia is also grown commercially in Australia and in the United States. This variety was introduced to Florida in 1973 by R.J. Knight. In the U.S., there are several spellings for this variety, perhaps based on slightly different pronunciations in different areas of Thailand. Pramkaimia is a mid-season variety. At Truly Tropical, it normally ripens in June and early July. Its mangoes grow in clusters on long panicles. The Promkaimia is a medium-sized, somewhat lanky and sprawling tree and is very productive and disease-resistant. Fruit of vastly different sizes can form on the same tree and even on the same panicle. The size of the fruit is influenced by how many fruit are on a panicle and on the tree. So this is Pram Kai Mia, and we're going to pick a few fruit. They actually can ripen at different stages, at different sizes. We've had fruit this size that have been just fine. Of course, there's not, a much, not much to taste there, but I think I see a few up top here that we can pick. So this is a full fruit, and that one will ripen fine off of the tree. Uh, this one was starting to turn yellow, and that will actually try, probably be good also. But if you're buying a Pram Kaimia, chances are you're going to want the bigger one. We tend to have some fruit on the ground. Some of it drops because it's ripe or there's wind. And uh, this one is full-sized and uh, close to ripeness, so it doesn't stay on the tree much longer than this. And uh, then we have other ones. This might have been on the ground if a few days, but this is ready to eat right now. Usually you don't have to wait for this color, uh, but this would be very delicious, and we will sample that when I get inside. There's a, a few fruit that drop because they split. So this one has dropped a long time ago. You can tell because of all the aging of the split. But when they split on the tree, usually they drop. So anyway, Prom Kaimia, nice fruit. We try and pick it before it drops, but if it drops, it's still very good. Our Prom Kaimia mangoes can weigh between four and 16 ounces. Even very small fruit can mature and have the full flavor of a large fruit. Skin color ranges from light green to a deeper green. Sometimes black spots develop on the skin of ripe fruit. These spots are superficial and don't affect the quality of the flesh. Pramkaimia is sometimes called the candy mango for its sweet taste, 
even before it ripens. This variety is often eaten when just mature but not ripe. In many cultures, this stage is known as raw. In Thailand, Promkaimia mangoes are usually eaten at this raw stage. The raw mangoes are crunchy, fiberless, and sweet, and often eaten with dipping sauces or spices. The fruit is also delicious when ripe. When Promkaimia is ripe, the flesh is deep orange, very rich, and sweet.